Lauren, Pumpkin. Shannon addresses ex Josh Eford's recent car crash, denies accusing Josh of trying to get insurance payout check and more. Lauren, Pumpkin. Shannon and Josh Eford's divorce was finalized Monday, but the former couple ended up in the news this week for another reason after Josh was in a serious car accident Tuesday that ended with the Mama June. Family Crisis star's truck getting flipped upside down. Pumpkin has since spoken out about the wreck, denying many of the reports from YouTuber LB, who broke the news of Josh's accident during a live stream on Tuesday. The Mama June star insisted that LB's claim that Pumpkin had refused to go to the hospital to check on Josh due to her believing her ex intentionally wrecked his truck in hopes of getting an insurance payout was false. According to LB's video, Josh was hit by a vehicle that was driving around 65 miles per hour causing his truck to flip. LB noted that, while none of Josh and Pumpkin's four children were in the vehicle at the time of the crash, Josh himself was reportedly knocked unconscious in the wreck, but was later woken up by those who pulled over to the scene of the accident. LB also reported that because Pumpkin was still listed as Josh's emergency contact, police contacted her to let her know what happened. The YouTuber stated that, according to her source, Pumpkin later told a friend that she wasn't planning to go to the hospital to see her ex-husband because she felt Josh was probably just looking for a check. On Wednesday, Pumpkin took a moment during a Facebook Live event for her and sister Alana, Honey Boo Boo, Thompson's The Sister's Closet brand to respond to some of the claims made about Josh's accident. In a clip later posted to Reddit, Pumpkin called the stories insane before going on to deny ever accusing Josh of intentionally wrecking his vehicle for a check. I never even done that, she said. Adding that, Josh called me first of all, they didn't even get that right he called me, he said, I'm at the end of Laurel Branch, I wrecked my truck, I said, all right, I'm on the way. So, I went down there. He was laid out on the ground, but his truck was overturned, it was upside down. But yeah, the stories are insane about the whole thing because somebody else said that Josh didn't even contact me, and that, somebody else, contacted me, because I was his emergency contact, Pumpkin later said on the live stream. Like, no, Josh called me. Pumpkin said after Josh was loaded into the ambulance at the scene of the accident, she contacted his mom to let her know that Josh was being taken to the hospital and that he was okay. According to Pumpkin, Josh's mom met him at the hospital, and then he went to his house. Pumpkin then mentioned the claim that Josh had been knocked unconscious as a result of the accident, seemingly denying that it had happened or at least not to her knowledge, anyway. Regarding the reports surrounding the aftermath of the accident, Pumpkin argued that she could speak on what had actually occurred. I was there, she said. Mind you, I was there. So crazy. As for those questioning why she showed up to the scene of Josh's accident, Pumpkin reminded fans that Josh is still the father of my kids. I wanted to make sure for my kids sake, truly and honestly, that he was okay, she said. The Ashley broke the news that Josh and Pumpkin were granted a divorce on Monday, just months after Pumpkin filed to end their six-year marriage. The exes who share kids Ella, Stella, Silas and Bentley were able to reach an agreement on all issues of the divorce, including a joint parenting plan, custody, division of property and debt, and alimony. Despite their divorce being finalized just days ago, both parties moved on months ago, with Pumpkin currently dating Josh's cousin, Darren Kitchens, and Josh allegedly dating a woman named Keeley, who is reportedly pregnant with Darren's child. Mama June's daughter Pumpkin finalizes divorce after six years of marriage. Mama June's daughter Lauren, Pumpkin, Eford is closing the chapter on her marriage of six years. The TLC star's daughter has officially finalized her divorce from Josh Eford, as they both return to the singles market. Lauren filed to end the June 2018 union in August after months of separation. Their split also involved settling crucial matters like child custody and other issues. Lauren, Pumpkin, Eford is ready for a fresh start. She is officially leaving her marriage and embracing a new phase in her life. Mama June's daughter agree on child custody with Josh Eford. On September 23, a Georgia judge officially approved their divorce, wrapping up a process that began with their separation in July 2023. The two had been apart for months before deciding to formalize the split. Surprisingly, the former couple amicably agreed to share joint legal and physical custody of their four children, Ella, six, Bentley, two, and twins Silas and Stella, one. Despite the end of their marriage, they remain committed to co-parenting. However, Pumpkin will have the final say in important decisions regarding their education and medical care. According to court documents obtained by InTouch, neither of them will receive child or spousal support under their settlement. The custody agreement also stated, The parties shall each have the right to take the children to a place of worship of their choosing during their parenting time, 
and each shall have the right to sign the children up for extracurricular activities. More details of the former couple's co-parenting terms. The divorce agreement outlined how the couple would handle their children's needs. Pumpkin and Josh agreed to split any medical expenses not covered by insurance and school-related and extracurricular costs. While custody exchanges will occur at Pumpkin's residence, their kids can contact either parent whenever they wish, as long as it does not interfere with their schedules. Additionally, the agreement states that both parties are legally free to move on with their lives and even remarry. The estranged couple came to an agreement in August. The Blast reported Pumpkin and Josh's divorce and their agreement regarding their children. Court documents filed in Wilkinson County, Georgia, revealed that Pumpkin described their relationship as irretrievably broken. This led to a complete agreement on every aspect of their separation, with both waiving their rights to alimony. Regarding taxes, Pumpkin was to claim their two youngest children, Bentley and Stella, on her income tax returns, while Josh claimed their eldest kids, Ella and Silas. Josh also agreed to move out of the family home in Gordon, Georgia, and his name will be removed from the lease, leaving his ex-wife in charge. The exes would also retain their own vehicles and bank accounts. Mama June wins custody battle for granddaughter Caitlin. While Pumpkin and her ex-husband may be moving on from their divorce, her mother, Mama June, is celebrating a major victory in court. After a contentious legal battle with her late daughter Anna, Chickadee, Cardwell's ex-husband, Michael Cardwell, Mama June successfully retained custody of her granddaughter. The Blast noted that the custody dispute was finally resolved on September 20 when a court ruled, legal and physical custody of the minor child is to remain with Mama June. As per the court order, Michael is prohibited from contacting the 11-year-old or Mama June unless they mutually agree to allow him visitation. Caitlin, who has been living with her grandmother since her mother fell ill, testified at a July hearing, where she expressed her strong desire to remain with Mama June. The TV personality accused late daughter's ex of abuse. Michael had sought custody of Caitlin, claiming he wanted to reunite her with her younger sister Kylie, who he also raises. Mama June, however, fought back, arguing that the preteen's best interests would be served by staying with her, where she has lived since Anna's cancer diagnosis. Tensions escalated when Michael alleged that Mama June and Anna were not on good terms before the latter's death, an accusation Mama June firmly denied. The 45-year-old countered by accusing Michael of physical abuse during his marriage to Anna, stating, During his marriage to Anna, Michael frequently physically abused Anna and the child, and it would not be in the child's best interests to be in Michael's care and control. For Lauren, Pumpkin Eford and Josh Eford, the finalization of their divorce brings a sense of closure as any lingering issues no longer bind them. Often, custody battles or child support concerns can keep ex-couples connected long after a relationship ends, but that is not the case for this pair.